Greetings, children. It's me, Captain Disillusion. I've been slacking off lately, taking on easy challenges like commercial viral videos or reptilians. But enough is enough. Tonight, I'm upping my game. I'm going to deconstruct one of the most requested videos ever. I'm talking about the mystery known as the Pantry Ghost. In this series of videos, a homeowner documents his encounters with a ghostly apparition of a young girl in his kitchen pantry. One of the videos even features an alleged skeptic Hi, I'm John. who is invited to the house to witness the ghost for himself with disturbing consequences. Oh my God. The videos seem direct, understated and realistic. That is, until now. Buckle up and get ready for a debunking of the decade. First, there's the door opening by itself, which in such a dark shot can be accomplished any number of ways. Using a string, for instance. Then, for the apparition itself, the old compositing tricks come in. Here, the camera is locked off, so it's a simple matter of superimposing a photoshopped image. Whereas here, it's a complicated camera move. Um, granted, this may have involved some 3D motion tracking, but if we bump up the levels in the image, we can easily see signs of compositing. Let's see. Um, okay, uh, I may have to analyze these videos a bit closer, but... I mean, that doesn't mean that... It's... Look, ghosts aren't real. This I know. And the way that these, these fake hoax videos were done is... Uh... Is... A ghost. You're wrong. How can you What if it's a ghost? How can you don't know the There is no answer. Captain Disillusion, I presume. Charles Darwin. <laughs> well, not exactly. I'm James Randi, and this is the Isaac Asimov Library of the James Randi Educational Foundation. Wow. What am I doing here? We've had our eye on you for quite some time now, young man. A self-appointed hero defending cyberspace against video fakery. You're making quite a stir. Not anymore. I've been beaten. I don't know how these pantry ghost videos were done. I'm out of the game. Maybe I can help deal you back in. You figured out the technique. Ha! Clever boy. Lights. Four videos, all showing the same paranormal events from a variety of angles and even through handheld shots. I've combed through all of them. There's no sign of trickery. Oh, there is. If you think outside the digital realm, your average video hoaxer is not as likely to employ advanced visual effects technology as he is to use the simple resources available in his home. A secret door. Precisely. It's not unheard of for pantries to be built with hidden compartments for aesthetic reasons. This Jeremy put a real girl into the pantry space. She pressed her face against the glass and opened and closed the secret door, which caused the real pantry door to open on its own from air pressure. You got it. Thanks to you, I could never... This would have bugged me for ages. Well, you know, Captain, you shouldn't feel alone in your efforts to defend reality. Today, there are countless skeptics all over the world, each encouraging education and rational thinking in their own unique way. Isn't that right? That's right, Mr. Randy, sir! You can see Mr. Flair, too? Mr. Who? I was talking to my assistant, Sean. 
I'd like to give you something. With this device, you can communicate with any skeptic in the world. So if you get in trouble, just, just activate, activate it. Thank you, Randy. I'll keep that in mind. What happens now? Well, now you go home. <sighs> this isn't the warm hole for home. I had no idea. Register for the amazing meeting. Some celestial event? No, no words, no words can describe. It's Vegas. <laughs>